Hello friends, in this video we will be discussing vector integration, type 1 line integration and this is our second example. Welcome back friends. Let's have a look on the given problem. f bar is equal to y square cos x plus z cube i plus 2y sin x minus 4j plus 3x z square plus 2 is irrotational. Also find scalar potential and work done from 0, 1, minus 1, 2, pi by 2, minus 1 and 2. Problem is exactly similar to the last problem. Same way, there are three parts asked. The first one is to prove it is irrotational. Irrotational is same as conservative. You will get two marks for this. Then we need to find scalar potential, two marks for this. And finally, for work done, two marks for this. Let's start solving the problem. First of all, we're going to prove whether it is irrotational or not. What to do for that? Yes, we need to prove curl of f bar is equal to 0. Let's check whether it is 0 or not. Let's start. First part, curl of f bar is equal to del cross f bar, which is equal to i, j and k dou by dou x, dou by dou y, dou by dou z. First is with i, whatever we have, we're going to write it down as it is. That is y square cos x plus z cube. With j, 2y sin x minus 4. And finally, with k, we do have 3x z square plus 2. Let's solve this determinant and try to prove whether the answer is 0 or not. I in bracket, I'm going to find the determinant, going to leave the first column, first row and cross multiply. That is dou by dou y of 3xz square plus 2 minus dou by dou z of 2y sin x minus 4 minus j. With j, I'm going to leave this and this that is dou by dou x 3xz square plus 2 minus dou by dou z y square cos x plus z cube and finally plus k with k I'm going to leave this therefore that will be dou by dou x of 2y sin x minus 4 minus dou by dou y of y square cos x plus z cube. Let us simplify this i. First of all, we're going to differentiate with respect to y. With respect to y, this entire term is 0. Constant, therefore derivative is 0. Minus. With respect to z, the entire term is constant. Derivative is 0 minus j with respect to x 3z square constant x derivative is 1 plus 2 derivative is 0 minus with respect to y with respect to z this entire term is constant it is 0 and z cube is 3z square plus k finally with respect to x this 2y is a constant sin x derivative is cos x minus 4 derivative is 0 minus with respect to y cos x is constant y square derivative is 2y z cube derivative is 0 this is cancelled this is cancelled ultimately you got the answer as 0 since curl of f bar is equal to 0, therefore vector is irrotational. First part of the solution is done and you will get 2 marks for this. So 2 marks fixed. Let's move on to get 2 more marks. The second part is scalar potential. Scalar potential means 
phi. We need to find phi. Do you remember the technique of scalar potential? What we do? Do phi upon do x, it is fixed. Do phi upon do y, and finally we do write do phi upon do z. What you write here? is your f1 f1 means whatever with the i you're going to write it down here that is y square cos x plus z cube here you're going to write it on f2 that means whatever with j you're going to write it down here that is 2y sin x minus 4 and finally do phi by do z whatever with the k you're going to write it down here that is 3x z square plus 2 I want phi, therefore I need to integrate. This is my f1, this is my f2, and this is my finally f3. Let's integrate. Here I'm going to integrate with respect to x. For the second, I'm going to integrate with respect to y, and for the last, I'm going to integrate with respect to z. Let's integrate with respect to x. When you integrate with respect to x, you're going to treat y and z constant. Therefore, this y square is constant cos x integration is sin x cos x derivative is minus sin x cos x integration is plus sin x plus z cube this z cube is constant one integration is x this is integration with respect to x here I'm going to integrate with respect to y because in the denominator I have y. Let's do that. 2 sin x is constant. y integration is y square by 2. Minus 4 is constant. We are integrating with respect to y. Therefore, it will be y. For the last term, I'm going to integrate with respect to z. Let's do that. 3x z square integration z cube by 3 plus 2 z this is same that is y square sin x plus z cube x here it is 2 2 got cancelled y square sin x minus 4 y and in the last this got cancelled and we are left with x z cube plus 2 z as discussed, what is phi? We're going to write it on all the terms without a repetition. Let us start. The first term is y square sin x. I'm going to add into the list. What next? Z cube x. Let's take it. What next? Y square sin x already covered. Leave it. Minus 4y not covered yet. We'll take it x z cube this is done see here this is done not going to take it again and finally it is 2z that i'm going to take this is my scalar potential phi i'll get two marks for this let's move on to achieve our last two marks that is work done again we do have trick for this work done formula is integration of f bar dot dr bar do you remember what to do here yes just write an integration just write a derivative and write it down the scalar potential that you got as it is that means you want to write it down this scalar potential as it is that is y square sin x plus z cube x minus 4y and finally it is 2z what next cancel this show this in the exam right integration derivative and cancel it you are left with y square sin x plus z cube x minus 4y plus 2z and what are the points given it is going from where to where it's going from 0 1 minus 1 up to pi by 2 minus 1 and 2 let us substitute upper minus lower limit which is equal to in x i am going to replace pi by 2 y is minus 1 and z is 2 this x is pi by 2 sine pi by 2 is 1 this y square minus 1 square is 1 that means it is 1 this term is 1 if i substitute here 
z cube 2 cube is 8 x x is pi by 2 if I'll substitute here this y is minus 1 therefore this will become plus 4 and finally if I'll substitute here that will become plus 4 upper limit 1 let's substitute the lower limit that is this x I'm going to substitute 0 y I'm going to replace 1 and z I'm going to replace minus 1 if you replace x with 0 sin 0 0 here also x 0 entire term is 0 you will be left with this term y is 1 minus 4 and in the last term z is minus 1 that is minus 2 let's simplify this this is 4 9 plus 4 pi plus 6 which is equal to 15 plus 4 pi is the required answer of work done 2 marks for this you got 6 marks hope you understood thank you